Hey, what's up everybody? This is Reggie with uh, Keller Williams Stock Metro. I'm here looking at a, a new listing that just came on the market. Super excited about it. Uh, this property I actually want to try to buy for myself. Uh, super excited about this home. Uh, I want to get it for myself and either flip it or uh, buy it, fix it up and rent it out. So we're going to walk this thing. I'm just going to point some stuff out to you and uh, we'll make an offer on it later on today. So yeah, walking in, you got the kitchen on the left hand side. This is actually in pretty decent shape, but it could use some upgrading. Looks like the cabinets are looking pretty good, but I'd probably change out the countertop. Um, then over here on this wall, there's a huge hole in the drywall. So looking at things like this, I'm actually really excited when I see this stuff. Because I know personally it's an easy thing to fix, but a lot of homeowners or people that want to buy to live in, they're afraid of seeing stuff like this everywhere. So we got another drywall hole right here, obviously. That's an even bigger one. Um, so let's just keep on walking through this property. And I'll just keep pointing stuff out. So we got the main living room over here. Same thing. There's this little little area that have been fixed up, but not very well. So here's a first for me too. This slider door. They tried to seal it up. So you actually can't even open this door. If you look at it, you can see they tried to seal everything up. Again, easy fix. But to a lot of people, they're not going to want to buy this home just because of a lot of little things like this. Uh, flooring needs to be replaced as well. So this is a four bed, two bath. It's 1,212 square feet. They got it just under $400,000. Obviously both bathrooms. Both bathrooms need to be fixed up. So that's the first bathroom. Yeah, it's beautiful. I know, I'm excited too, Finn. So all the siding on the door, the trim needs to be replaced. This door needs to be replaced. Flooring needs to be replaced. The, the rooms are a little small. It's a four bed, like I said, and it's only 1,200 square feet. But uh, you could make one of these an office and just call it a three bed, two bath, or keep it as a four plus two, whatever you want to do. Uh, again, multiple holes in the drywall. Kind of hard to see because the lighting's not so great in here. But super, super easy fixes. We'll just work our way on the right hand side. Again, they probably had animals or something. I don't know. All this trim is knocked off this door and there, there's actually no door here either. So another easy fix. Broken window. Probably get that window replaced for under $500. Installed, new, good to go. We got a shed out back. Yeah, we got some built-ins. Oh, you're coming from the wrong side there, bud. There you go. And then this is the fourth bedroom. So there isn't really a uh, primary suite, so to speak. They're all about the same size rooms. They're all pretty small. But if there was, this is it. <clears throat> because you got the second bathroom right in here. Same thing. It's all needs to be redone. Little bathrooms like this, you can get this thing professionally tiled, redone. This whole bathroom could be redone for, I'd say, under seven grand, pretty easy. And that's with using pretty good vanity, uh, good fixtures, new toilet, nice tile. Same thing. Lots of little blemishes everywhere. We can't access the backyard because the slider is a, a permanent fixture now. <laughs> so we'll have to go through the garage. So let's check out the garage. Oh yeah, look at that. So hopefully the garage door works. If not, we can always replace that. But we got some cabinets over here in the corner. All this drywall needs to be redone, retextured. Or we can just take it down and put some new up. Yeah. Lots of work needed. It looks good. Alright. So this is the side of the house. Again, we need some new paint everywhere. We got some cracks in the stucco. 
<coughs> Bless you. Oh man, it's really bright. That H track needs to be replaced. All right, that's the house. So like I was saying, I'm gonna come up with a number. We'll look at how much uh, all this stuff is gonna cost and uh, we'll draw up a contract and an offer and send this out and see if they accept our offer. Chances are they may not, but it never hurts just to throw it at them and see if they like it.